Welcome to a 10 minute guided meditation for the full moon in Libra happening on April 4th or 5th, 2023. Besides just doing a guided meditation, which will allow you to get some clarity on the themes coming up for you personally this full moon, I am leaving some journal prompts for you down in the description as well. You can use these to reflect after the meditation, just to allow you to take your time a little bit further and go deeper on some of the things that may be coming up for you. Go ahead and close your eyes and let's get started. And we'll begin here by taking a deep inhale through the nose. and exhaling out the mouth. Inhale through the nose. And exhale out the mouth. One more time, inhale. Begin to feel where your legs are touching the ground underneath you. And if you're lying down, take notice of all the places that your back is supported by the bed. Pull your shoulders away from your ears. Tuck your chin slightly. And imagine somebody has a string tied to the top of your head and is pulling up. Lengthening your spine. the axes of Aries and Libra is about how we exist as an individual and how we exist in relationship. Go ahead and imagine you are compromising. Imagine yourself in whatever situation where you are putting the other ahead of yourself. Notice how this feels for you. Is this a happy situation where you love to see the smile of the other person? Or is this a situation that makes you feel resentful? That tenses the muscles in your body? Go ahead and release this image.
imagine now a situation where you are on your own. Wherever it may be and no matter what you're doing, you are pursuing what you want to do. You are being unapologetically selfish. Notice how this situation feels. Do you feel light? Like a weight has been lifted off of your shoulders? Or do you feel sad? unfulfilled, bored, lonely. Go ahead and pick the situation that didn't feel so easy. We usually all have one side of the spectrum that we fall more towards. And this exercise can show us through the feeling which side we're not so comfortable with yet. So pull up that image again, that situation again. And turn the feeling into something more enjoyable. Try to feel the wonderful parts of that image, of that situation. And see if you can exist here in this space. Coming to it the second time around in this meditation. but this time with a different feeling attached to it. Feel the love the happiness, the gratitude, the appreciation, whatever emotion it is for you right now, start to swell up in your heart, getting warm, let it radiate from the heart out towards the whole chest, into the arms, down the torso, up the neck and shoulders, into your face and your head, down into your legs and feet. Feel 
feel this heat and swelling move beyond you into the surface underneath you and into the whole room you're in right now. Go ahead and gently open your eyes and let yourself slowly come back to the space you're in and out of the meditation. I hope you enjoyed that meditation. The axis of Aries and Libra is quite an interesting one. And I think a lot of people, when it comes to this axis, can have quite a strong opinion on one side versus the other. And as I always preach with almost every full moon meditation, is that neither side is better than the other. It's always about the balance. And a lot of the times it's about the learning and challenging ourselves to go to the side that we maybe feel a little bit less comfortable with. As I said earlier, if you feel like you want to reflect a little bit further, I have left journal prompts for you down in the description. And it's only the beginning of April. So if you're curious and you do want support for the rest of April, I highly suggest watching this April astrology guide. Thank you so much for joining me today and I hope to see you again soon.